Today we will talk about Malaysia. Malaysia is the southeast uh, Asian country. Uh, my city is Kuala Lumpur. The first day, we are going to Petron Twin Tower. Petron Twin Tower were the tallest uh, building in the world. Now is uh, Burj Khalifa is the tallest uh, building in the world. But now uh, the Twin Towers are the tallest Twin Tower in the world. So. These two towers are joined in the half of them in the sky bridge. Uh, for the first one, in the first uh, first tower on floor 41, and the second one on floor 42, they are joined in the half by sky bridge. So you can go from the first tower to the second tower by the sky bridge. The the tower are visible visible from everywhere in the city, and. Uh, it has a good view, and also in the night you can recognize it, recognize them from everywhere. Petron, Petronas Tower are open six days a week, and they offer a trip to the first tower, to the sky bridge, and uh, they offer a uh, observation roof uh, on floor 86 for the second tower. This is for the first day. The second day, we are going to Chinatown. Chinatown is an area in Kuala Lumpur which never sleep. Uh, it's the most colorful than the rest of the city. It has a lot of color, beautiful color. Chinatown always full of people all over the world. Many gorgeous place. It has many gorgeous places to visit. Chinatown has a lot of culture and history. Uh, and it's one of the most uh, popular spots in Malaysia to visit. The people in Chinatown always tr uh, try to bargain for the best price, uh, which it has a lot of uh, Chinese herbs uh, and uh, second quality stuff. The next day, Batu Caves, the third day, Batu Caves located in the north of Kuala Lumpur, Beitou Caves is, is made of stone hill, uh, which has uh, three kinds of caves and some other smaller caves. The Beitou Caves is 100 years old. It has uh, 100 years old. It has a statue inside of the main caves and around it that statue, status. The Beitou Caves uh, ha has many Hindu places uh, for the Hindu religion to visit. So basically it's the most uh, popular place to, uh, to the Hindu place for to do their religion. That's it. About that. And uh, at the night we go to the Loved uh, mosque in the southeast, and it has uh, four uh, manara, and uh, it's close of the many music, and it's a great view at the night for the photography and the tourists when they take a picture. And uh, the second day, we go to the Jintigin. Jintigin uh, is a is a uh, is a high a high land uh, for family uh, attraction. And this park, for uh, and this park, affording uh, recreational uh, activity like the rich family and the rich uh, child and video games, and uh, you can uh, climb uh, climb the tower. Uh, it has uh, two tower and has uh, many kind of uh, restaurants and. Uh, uh, and, and this uh, uh, engine tank uh, it has uh, 50 tires of reds, like uh, holes and swings and uh, curves and uh, car and uh, train and ship and uh, boat. Well, Penang, first of all, Penang it's a different city than Kuala. It's an Iceland and it's a quiet, so there is no high, high building there or a nightlife. So we're gonna spend the first night in Binang in Binang Hale. 
and the journey is supposed to take, used to take 30 minutes, but now after they are upgrading the system, it's taking like 10 minutes. What they have up there, they have a museum and a lovely view to the city, and they have also like uh, love lock, like Paris, and uh, they have also a, a local famous restaurant and a hotel. So we're gonna spend the first night in being there. The second night, we're gonna we we're gonna go to uh, Kitlock Sai Temple. It's in English supposed to mean like Temple of Paradise. It's a Buddhist temple and also the, the largest temple uh, in Southeast Asia. And uh, what they have, they have I think they have a small uh, uh, a small um, gift shop also there to buy a shop as a gift. And I think all the all the Buddhist religion is supposed to get here like once in the life to pray or uh, to pray, yeah. And uh, that's it.